What's up everyone, Tina here and in today's video I'm very excited to share with you that click tracking is now available inside of campaigns. This comes in really handy if you're running a launch for example and you're sending out a lot of emails within one week or two weeks or really short time of period. So instead of keep sending all the emails to all the people, you can really track and you can go inside your statistics. You can see who clicked on which link and retarget those people because people who clicked on your link are the ones who are most interested. This allows you to segment your list even further and to really identify quality leads. Also, by understanding your subscribers' engagement, you can really gauge interest levels and tailor your content accordingly. So let me show you how you can set this up. First, you want to click on marketing on the left, emails at the top and select campaigns. You then want to create a new campaign by clicking on the add new button or simply clone an existing campaign. In this case, just let's clone one. Let's edit it. Click on it. And here you can see the regular email builder popping up. You can add your elements, your images, your videos, your text, but most importantly, your links. So if you click on this text here and you click on the hyperlink, you can see I've added already a link here. And I've also added a button with a hyperlink going to Google. Let's click save. Then let's click send or schedule. Let's send it definitely now. Add your sender email, add your sender name, add your subject line. You can also use Content AI to help you find a suitable subject line. Then you add your preview text. You can also use custom values here. Let's say contact first name, open now. And down here you can choose who are your recipients. In this case, we just want to add one recipient. And then this one is the new settings. So you toggle on track clicks okay so every single time somebody clicks on this google.com link i've just added to the template the system tracks that and let's hit send and here you can see my email has already arrived let's scroll down and let's click on those links let's go back to our system let's refresh the page and here you can see the status has been changed to send now there's two places where you can access statistics number one on the statistic tab right here and number two click the three dots right next to the template or the campaign you just sent out and then select statistics. Here you can have a quick overview of what kind of email this was. Click load more statistics, scroll down to the bottom, and here you can see delivered, open, clicked, ordered, replied, and so on and so forth. Let's click on clicked, and you can see my demo name right here. The status says this person has clicked the link inside of your email. You can also go ahead and click the export button and you can export that list of people who clicked the link inside of your campaign and then send another campaign to only that list. X this out. Now click on statistics. Here you can adjust the date to get insights of all the campaigns you've sent within a week, for example. Down here you can see all the emails have been clicked. That's 100%. So this is a summary of all the campaigns you've sent within that specific time frame. That's not just the one campaign we've just investigated a few minutes ago. I've already sent three emails today or in that given time frame we selected above. Scroll further down and other most recent emails, you can see the click rate is 100%. You can also switch this toggle on and show statistics in numbers. 100% in this case was one email subscriber who clicked that link inside that email. Furthermore, you can click on each campaign down here again to get the data of this specific campaign. So let's click on that. That little window pops up again. Let's click on more statistics again. And up here, you can click the click performance. Here you can see the total clicks, the total unique clicks, the unique engagements and the clicks per unique open as well. The system will also show you the links in this email. So in case you have several links going, so you can really determine which link is the most popular one. You can also click on each link in order to get contact specific details and see exactly which person clicked on that particular link. Please note the current implementation does not support A-B testing or RSS campaigns and just works under marketing and campaigns and not inside of workflows. Also, the current implementation supports custom values, but not trigger links. That's it already. This is how you can now track links inside of your email campaigns. I will see you in the next video.